changing of the seasons comes the changing of the clock, and that means it's getting dark earlier, and that can mean pay, paying extra attention to safety when you're out. That's right, uh, and that's particularly true on college campuses where people tend to walk rather than drive from place to place. Rosalind Freeman went to the Mississippi University for Women campus to find out what the staff there is doing to keep students safe. Mississippi University for Women sits in the middle of Columbus. With the city running through and boarding campus, that means there are several entry points. The W's Chief of Campus Police urges students and faculty to keep safety tips in mind. Always to be mindful of their surroundings. A lot of times what I see students and individuals on campus is they become really focused on their electronic devices. Uh, so always walking with their head up. Chief Vibrock also says students are never too old to utilize the buddy system when walking around the campus. I always want to remind them that we have a safety walk program. Uh, so if the student doesn't feel comfortable walking on campus, they can call our department and we'll actually have an officer provide them with a walking escort anywhere on campus property at any time of the day or night. It's important to remember that if you see something suspicious on campus, your first call should be to the police. Uh, sometimes what we see is a, a delay in reporting sometimes. Um, you know, maybe they're concerned about, I don't know if this raises the level of calling the police. Uh, and my recommendation and what I always encourage students, if you think you should call the police, call the police. And before you go to social media for your news, know that the campus provides updates using the W Alert. The event that we have, an emergency situation that's going to impact the safety, immediate safety of individuals on campus, uh, we're able to push out an alert. And that's going to be a text message and then also push it out through email so campus community members are aware of the incident and how to respond to that incident. Telling your story in Columbus, Rosalind Freeman, WCBI News. The campus is conducting a lighting tour next Thursday to assess the lighting needs of the area. This is an important step towards ensuring the safety of students and faculty, especially during the darker hours of the day. 